Welcome back to BioInfo Tips. In today's tutorial, we're going to explore some advanced features of Marvin's Sketch DSA, powerful chemical drawing and editing tool. Specifically, we'll learn how to display atomic charges, change atom aliases, display lone pairs, and show explicit carbons. These techniques can be incredibly useful when working on chemical structures and reactions. So, without further ado, Let's dive right in. Once you have Marvin Sketch DS up and running, create a new document or open an existing one. For this tutorial, we'll start from scratch. Let's start by drawing a molecule on the canvas. You can use the drawing tools to create your chemical structure. I'll draw some carbon skeleton with the oxygen and nitrogen. Now, let's add the atomic charges to oxygen and nitrogen. Let's head to the left panel and select the minus symbol and add it to oxygen and the plus one to the nitrogen. Let's say you want to change one atom to an alias that represents a nucleophile, in this case denoted as Na. Right click on the atom and then atom properties. Then select pseudo and insert what you want on the pseudo field. Now to add lone pairs and slash or carbon labels, click on the floppy disk, select image, and then tick the show lone pairs and show carbon labels boxes. And there you have it. You've learned how to display atomic charges, change atom aliases, display lone pairs, and show explicit carbons in Marvin Sketch DES. These features can be incredibly useful for your chemical drawing and editing needs. If you found this tutorial helpful, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to BioInfo Tips for more chemistry and science-related content. If you have any questions or suggestions for future tutorials, please leave them in the comments section below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.